All right, thanks for coming back. I just filmed a whole video and then realized I didn't have my commentary on. <laughs> so we're just going to do this again here, and I'm going to try to address everything I just told nobody. Uh, well, thanks for coming back to watch another uh, another round of breaking bricks. But um, I had a a revelation today at work. This is what I do when I'm at work: is I think about Minecraft. It's crazy. Um, I said originally I wanted to do this in three phases, but I think I've changed my mind. Because uh, I started thinking if I get the other side done, because this is going to be two straight sides, and then the middle is going to be a connecting, like an arch, that connects the two straight sides together. But however, I'm... But however. However, I'm thinking that may be the wrong way to go about it, because if I screw up, and I don't have my sides lined up fairly good, I may have an ugly arch. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this floor out. I'm going to... Uh, and then this, uh, that actually has nothing to do with why I'm taking the floor out. I'll get to that next. Uh, I'm going to take this floor out, and then I'm going to grab a bunch of dirt, and I'm going to go, and I'm going to go from one end of the, the outside end of this dam, and I'm going to shoot straight out over the water, then I'm going to go to where I want the outside end of the other dam, and I'm going to shoot straight out like this, and I'm going to connect them at a 90-degree angle. And then I'm going to go to that 90-degree angle, and I'm going, to, I'm going to pillar up so I can get a lookout to see where I should start the arch to make them both oops, connect at an archway, you know, both the straight sides connect at an arch. That way, as I'd hate to get to that point and have this side totally done, and then think, oh man, I should have started my arch earlier or later or whatever. And then by that point, it's almost, you know, you're all in, you're already committed. So you just have to go with it and live with the result. So I think this is the way to go. And as far as this, I'm not going to do floors. I was telling you in the last video, I want to do like eight floors. That's not going to happen. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, I'm going to do two floors, 10 blocks high. And I'm going to turn this side and the other side into tree farms. Um, assuming I'm, I, I'm able to grow the trees indoor. Oh, yeah, that's going to work really well. I'm going to... Assuming I can grow the trees indoors. But that's what I'm hopeful. Because I wanted to have a couple uh, gates anyway. Run through the dam to irrigate farms that would be behind the dam. So I'm hopeful that I'm able to grow trees inside. And then I can have four chambers to grow um, trees. But we'll see. I mean, it's just a thought. And I'm hopeful that it'll work. And then I'll also canal out water through the back to irrigate crops on the ground. And I know you can just make water. But yeah, it'll look cool if it's coming from the, the dam. You know, that is the purpose of a dam. You know, hold water out and allow some to pass through. And so that's what I'm going to do. And then I'm hopeful that I can have a, a higher plateau with my big castle on it. So it would be almost like in, you know, the, the medieval days of the, I guess, I don't know, it's the Dark Ages or not, but the uh, time of the kings and the queens when you had uh, the farms and the, the villagers outside the castle and then, you know, you had the castle to keep the stronghold and all that. So that's kind of what I'm hopeful. We'll see. I don't know how it's going to plan out, and that's seriously weeks down the road. For now, I got to get this dam built, and then I got to get farms done. Then I'm going to start building the castle. And then I think maybe after that, I might try to build a suspension bridge from this island to the next one. We'll see. Oh, look at you. Give me some string, fool. Right. Did a little bit of damage, but I'm alright. Um, so anyway, that's my plan. We'll see how it, how it comes into play here. But for right now, I'm just busting down blocks to take out this floor. And then once I get this done, let's uh, start making plans for the, for the rest of the dam. So I can 
envision that this dam is going to look really nice when it's done. I just have to make sure I get it all laid out first, I think. There's the wall with that Enderman behind it. Part of me wants to go in there. And I think once I'm ready, and I start ready for, and I start needing redstone and diamonds and everything, I'm going to go in there and I'm going to tunnel down and I'm just going to not stop until I get bedrock. Take a bunch of ladders, a bunch of torches, a bunch of pickaxes, and just go to town. And, um,. Then when I have my own little mining hole, hopefully I can, you know, find a, a nice branch or a nice uh, uh, cave system with a bunch of minerals in it to where I can, you know, have a nice little uh, mining operation right out of the bottom of my dam. I wish I would have thought of this yesterday and I wouldn't have to break all this stuff out. Oh, there we go again. But yeah, stick around and uh, you should subscribe to the channel if you're interested in seeing the long-term uh, operations from a from a noob. You know, because I'm learning. I'm learning quickly and I won't be a noob forever. And I know with games like SimCity and stuff, I've built some pretty damn impressive cities. So just stick around. Bear with me. But please throw me some suggestions too, you know. And some, there's some people watching the videos, few and far between, but they're getting some hits. And, uh, you know, just throw me some suggestions. I mean, I know I'm a noob, but you don't got to be a jerk because I'm a noob. I like the game. I mean, not my fault I work 45 hours a week and raise a couple kids in until, you know, I really probably play this a little more than I should right now, but it's all right. I go through phases where I have a game of choice. Like, I played Game of War for about a year. And I played, uh, you know, before that, it was like, God, I can't even remember. And then Ages of, Ages of Empires. And uh, I got through phases where I'll bust out Sim City every now and again. And I got a huge metropolitan city on there. And I've been working on for, off and on for 10 years. Um, you know, and it just goes in phases. And when I get into a game, I kind of obsess on them a little bit. But I guess that's probably the same for anyone who'd be watching this damn video right now. Uh, so, I don't really feel bad about it. I enjoy it. It doesn't really get in the way of my family time, so... As soon as the, the wife and kids get home and everything, I'm, I'm pretty much wrapped it up. And like I told you before, my son has a YouTube channel too, so it's actually a good way for us to, to bond and be able to talk about Minecraft, so... And I do enjoy it, so... Anyways, I'll let you guys watch this for a couple minutes, and then I'll cut it off, and uh, I'll, I'll start recording again once I get to the point of surveying or laying out the the archway and trying to come up with a game plan for that. So, anyways, hope you guys uh, enjoy watching me smash cobblestone. I'm moving around and wasting time. Yeah, I think pretty soon I'm going to start trying to, like, I don't know if I can uh, enhance iron or stone items, but I'm gonna, I think I'm going to give it a try just to learn. I haven't enhanced anything yet. Thought about messing around with it right now, but I got to spend my time doing this kind of stuff. Once I get the dam built, and then it'll be time to really start prioritizing um, what I'm going to do as far as with my resources and being organized, where I'm going to keep all my slime. Because I'm thinking if this is going to be where I grow the wood or harvest the wood, then the top, because like I said, I'm going to do two, two floors, 10 feet, 10 blocks tall. So, and this is 23 just to the surface, just to the top block there. But I'm going to exceed that by probably 
I don't know, I'm thinking eight blocks or so, six or eight blocks above the water um, for the walkway and everything. And then that'll give me probably damn near 10 blocks to work with on the top so I can make that my home for now. And you know, I can keep all my chests in there and uh, then I should have ample space on both, between both sides to store all my items, you know, so I can have one chest for oak, one chest for birch, one chest for stone, one chest for, you know, whatever, 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 one chest for slime, and then maybe I'll make some signs to uh, help me out with that. Because if I want, you know, to build a bunch, of, when I build, when I make slime blocks, I don't want to just build one. You know what I'm saying? I want to be able to grab three or four stacks of slime and three or four stacks of whatever else. I think you need iron. I forget what you need to make slime. But whatever it is, I want to be able to grab a bunch of it and just go to town and make, you know, stacks of them and then have another chest just for that. Um, but we'll see. You know, time, time is something... Apparently, you need to have a lot of when you play this game on survival. But I'll tell you, it's more fun. I'm having more fun playing this game on survival than I did playing in creative. And, and I, you know, that's why I started playing creative. Because like Sim City, I like to build things. You know, I like to watch things grow. And But it was just too easy. I got too bored with it in, in creative. But... Well, that's about it. I'll shut up and stop blathering on. Just hit that subscribe button. Throw it a thumbs up. If you think so, you know someone that might have some pointers for me or whatever, share this video with them. My ears are open, and as long as you're not a total ass in the comments, I'll, I'll give your suggestions some uh, uh, the appropriate level of consideration. But just don't be a dick because I'm a noob. Appreciate that. Anyways, like, share, subscribe to the next video. You guys have a great day, and I'm out.